so once again as a video i'm going to show you how can you create a test in your test portal so in last video i showed you how you can sign into your test portal and this video i have told you i'm going to show you in my last video uh, how to create a test in test portal so let's go into our today's video it's basically uh, done for teachers and for creating a test in test portal you just want to go and click on new test at the top so which i'm highlighting right now and click on the option so after you click on a particular option it will be something like this fill all the information which they are asking test name so give a test name which you have been decided so after you give uh, every uh, after you give a test name just go directly and click on create don't care about uh, everything else that is all nothing so click on create at the, la the last which i'm highlighting right now for you guys and click on that particular option after click on the particular option you're gonna get, get some page like this some page like this which i'm highlighting right now so from this particular page you should select the uh, arrow mark one which i arrow mark add questions to the next which is in red color written in the red color add questions so you should click on that this particular option so i'm going to click on that option add questions so this is here you can add questions by clicking on this option you can add questions for your test so i'm going to show you how can you add questions from here you're going to click you're going to basically click on add questions so without wasting time click on add questions After click on add questions, there will be questioning pop-ups. So you can see question number one and you can add. So it will take time to load because my internet speed is slow. Yes guys, yes friends and it have been arrived. So after that you can add questions, some questions up here. So I'm gonna add some uh, unknown questions so after that category no need of category no need of choosing category and how to change the question type like answer type so if there is an uh, option like there's an option like answer type and if you click on that there is many many options one minute guys so uh, there is many many options like single choice multiple choice descriptive true or false short answer and survey you can choose any of them as how the children should answer you guys so if you descriptive type you can choose to descriptive type so right now i'm gonna choose on my, uh, true or false so click on true, true or false i'll click on true or false there will be two options arriving on you so uh, write true or false okay so i'm gonna keep this uh, answer only on here so after type your correct answer uh, one correct answer one wrong answer how to identify which is correct and which is wrong right for that so uh, how to connect manually okay I mean uh, automatically by the machine. So for that, if you're gonna go, go and the circle round out here, you should tick on that. Okay, you should tick on that to the correct answer, so the computer will correct automatically and give the answer to the children at that particular moment. Okay, so uh, put here a tick mark and click on that to for your correct answer. Okay, so if you want the computer to automatically correct the answers. Okay, if you all you want okay so after that what do you want to do means if you want to add more questions to the as a paper, as a question paper you can just go and click on the down one which is save and add next okay if you don't want to add you can just click on save okay so I'm just basically clicking on save because I, I'm just showing you guys I, I'm not a teacher I'm just a student so yeah after this, you're gonna get something like this from here. It's gonna be worried what to do. But uh, no need to worry, just click on testing, you know, at the side, okay, the left side, okay. So just click on that particular option. I'm gonna show you once more. So this option, just click on this particular option. So I'm gonna click on that. Then wait. Yeah, after that, the everything will be green out here. Even the question, okay, everything will be green out here. If everything is green, everything does done, okay? But not done, one more step, okay? The main thing. Test pass mark, you can read it. Test pass mark. You should give the test pass mark just by clicking it. Okay, you can look all of this and change according to you to you, okay? The timing and everything. I'm not gonna explain everything, it'll be very long. So you can check everything in this box and again uh, see it and if you want to change any of the things, you can go and just change. I 
but I just show you how can you uh, create test uh, questions and how to change password. So scroll down after you scroll down, there will be maximum possible scores 100 percentage. Then enter password. So password can be under uh, like to 25 maybe as your wish. Okay, you can just uh, type here, a little type here. Yeah, it's, it is it. So after that, after that, uh, yeah. So after you're gonna go and click on t uh, testing info. So you did not save the changes. Okay, we should change the save save uh, savings. So scroll down and save it. So after you save it, you're gonna click on test now. So, so to go back to the page. So we have reached So now go and click on test info. As I showed you the first, and now everything is done. Okay. Now your test is done, and now the last and final part is. Uh, Assign a category to the test if you want to assign a category, so you can assign a category. So now, so now you should click on the test in is in access mode. Okay, so this one public link. You should click on this particular thing to, in order to get the link. Okay, and share to the children. Okay, so click on that particular option, public link option. After click on the public link option, don't change anything in this. Just copy it, okay? Just by clicking out here, okay? Just by clicking out here, your link will be copied, and now you can go and paste it anywhere you need, okay? Now, how to activate the link? If you simply give the link, it will not work, okay? To do one more thing, okay? So, one minute, I have already started the test, so yeah. After you copy the link and give to someone, at the side, okay? At the side, there will be an option to assign test, okay? At the side. I'm gonna show you at the side there will be an option to assign test. I have already assigned test by mistakely. So instead of start again, there will be an option to assign test. Okay. If you click on assign test, uh, you can see something like this. And uh, in, fr in front you can see something, right? Something like this you can see. So here you're gonna see how much of them are writing, which page they are writing, and stuff like that. Okay. So this was a small video how to add questions how to create a test in my test portal so if you like my video please go and please please uh, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe and click the bell icon to receive all my latest updates like tech videos i bring up like this so helpful videos for teachers for children for parents for boys and everyone so see my next video till that goodbye and be safe at your home